Hey guys and welcome back to another season 10 gameplay guide. Today we're going to cover Diana in the top lane guys and we're also playing against the Wukong. Anyway, you can find the full runes as well as the full build in the description below as well as in the comment section. So make sure to check that out guys and with that being said, uh, let's focus on this matchup guide guys. So against the Wukong. So I consider Diana a top laner right now after the nerf, I mean after the mini rework has came through guys. She's got a rework about a couple of days ago and she's become, became a really good top laner right now. Anyway, I'm actually playing with magic resist ruins because I thought I was playing against Vladimir but it appears it's a Wukong so I'm not really happy with that. It's gonna make my laning phase slightly harder but it's okay we can, we can still win this one. I'm gonna take my W here. Very good. I'm gonna freeze this wave so that my I can make the lane gankable for my jungler. Just gonna water try bush. That's fine. Good. I'm just gonna focus on farming as much as possible right now and like doing short trades in between. Oh, what's going on? Okay, there we go. Nice. I can actually all in it right now. Yeah, got him. That's what I'm talking about. Like, Diana currently has amazing all in potential right now. And that's why I consider her a top laner at the moment. Remember, I'm not even playing with armor runes. And I already win this 1v1 right here. Very nice. Okay, I'm gonna go back here. I'm just gonna change my build. Uh, I'm just gonna like buy a few items so, and then teleport back so I don't miss too much. I'm gonna buy a secondary Doran ring, guys. I'm gonna go back here. I'm gonna buy two Doran ring. Uh, I mean, I'm Doran rings potions. All right, here we go. All right. Nice. Oh, we can actually go in all. We can actually go all in right now. We should win. Nice. If he comes back right now, we're gonna go free all in. He's gonna miss so much farm right now. Ah, we couldn't cancel. That's so unfortunate. Like, we could have made him fall behind so much. Hmm. Yeah, that's, uh, that's, that's quite unfortunate. But we're going to push in the next wave and then we're going to go back. Nice. Okay, there we go. Like, something that I like about Diana at the moment is the fact that she has got... She's got pretty good wave clear too right now. Like, she has always had really good wave clear. But now that she has her ultimate being on her E, she also has... The all-in potential around like the early few levels. This is something I like a lot, like which I like a lot so much about Diana top right now. I'm gonna buy. Uh, where can I find it? I need mana. Where is it? There we go. I'm also going to buy like uh, an extra available potion. Good. All right, so the first time I'm going to buy is going to be Rod of Ages. And after getting Rod of Ages, we are probably going to get the uh, Nashus to it. If we can get the Rod of Ages as well as the Nashus to it, Diana becomes a monster. She becomes insanely strong. That's the moment where Diana becomes extremely strong. I'm sure I'm here. Nice. Actually, I can shoot him again. There might actually be someone here right now because he's walking into the river, which seems very, very off right now. That was really strange. I didn't want to fight that because Zach was probably there right now. I'm just going to do the slow push. If he shows up, then... Uh, I'm not going to fight him because Zack might actually be topside right now. Very good. 
Let's push in the next wave too, and then we're gonna see if we can like do a row mid. Nice. This is pretty much how you play day and hour on the early few levels. You want to do either like short trading or on your side of the lane, or you want to like focus on going for all ends when the time is right, when he's got like halfway of the uh, HP bar. Nice. Oh, we can take him here. Oh, we almost got him there, man. Once again, walking away with that HP. It's amazing me every day. All right, at least as long as our farm is perfect, then we should be okay. There's like three people topside right now. I have to go back here because I'm not quite sure. Wait, actually, I can kill him. Okay. I need to bait him towards me. Maybe we can kill him if uh, if a move comes here. Gotta be careful of Zach though. Oh, okay. Let's go back here. If he gets close enough, I could go for all in, and we could make it work. I'll take the next one too and then I'll go back. The thing is I'm kind of farming up for my item right now. If I can get... The sooner I get my Rod of Ages, the better it's going to be. Nice. If he gets close, that would be amazing. But he probably doesn't. No, he's going to stay around this side. Uh, I'm just going to go back here. I'm gonna buy this and the good thing is I, we just took a wave so we can also buy the blasting wind right now which gives us like more damage okay so once again diana is a perfect champion towards like freezing the lane setting up the lane for gangs as well as like doing short trading and when the time is right that's when you want to look for the old lane pretty much around the early game but as soon as you get to the mid late game you want to play differently she's kind of like a split pusher slash uh all in depending on like the team fight of course depending on the position of everyone but she's mainly like a split pusher that tries to 1v1 people and like perhaps one shot backline and stuff like that that's where diana comes into place this draven is popping off he's popping off insanely hard wow okay let's see where this wukong is going to be Now, I'm not going to fight him right now. I'm going to wait for my E to come back and then we're going to fight him. Alright. I'm going to cheat a wave. I'm going to wait for Wukong to show up right now. We can fight him easily right now. Let's see if he gets close enough. We got, the only thing right now, we got to be careful of, uh, of Zack. I'm not gonna push. I want this Wukong to farm. No, he's not really giving me the chance. No. We're just gonna we're gonna just gonna sit tight and we're not gonna do that much because Zack is missing right now. I don't want to go too far anyway. See, we can all in him. Nice. We can take him now. Wow. <laughs> uh, that all was gone wrong here. I did never ex I never expected Wukong to actually jump there and try to outplay me. I did not expect this. But we got him anyway. This is pretty much how you play Diana within the laning phase, guys. This is pretty much how you do it. Uh, let me actually get one more planning before I go back, though. 
Oh, he's actually TPing? Okay, we're going back. See ya. We got TP now as well, so we will just... We will simply TP back to lane and uh, we're gonna be alright. Uh, let me take, like... Let me take some water. From my mouth. Mm. Oh, that's a lot better. So we already have Rod of the Ages, guys. Now let's actually go and buy some attack speed because we're gonna get Nash Astute right now. And this is the point in time where we get really strong right now. We're gonna go for all in because we can fight him really easily. Come on. Can we stop him? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we got him. Nice. You see, guys, Diana is really strong, actually. Diana is actually really strong in the current patch. Uh, she just got her mini rework. She does a ton of damage right now. It's literally insane. Do not be surprised if Diana is being nerfed, guys. Really, do not be surprised because she is over the line right now. She's being banned in pretty much every single game so far. You cannot really pick her up in the rank game, like, out of the thousands of times that I tried, I have never really got the chance to, because she's just being bent everywhere. So, don't be surprised if she might get, like, she might potentially be nerfed in the future, because she's just being broken right now, as far as I've seen. Her mid late game potential is insane. Her 1v1 potential is crazy. It's not normal. I'm not blaming Riot though, because I mean it, it's 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 just a rework. They need to fix it after, but you know, prepare yourself. Mm. We can't really fight him unless my ultimate comes back. But also, is Black playing really safe right now? Let's go back here. I really, really, really want to fight him, but I'm just not getting the chance right now. Gonna take one more. Nice. Okay, let's go back here. We have enough right now. So the next thing uh, we're going to buy is gonna be, you can either uh, go for Ninja Tabis or Mercs if you don't really have a tank in the team but what you can also do you can actually buy this and do even more damage when trying to go like for the all-in trying to watch uh you know instantly kill people oh james going top side already that's no problem the best thing for us to do right now is going bot lane and like pushing out completely but we can also go mid here But yeah, we got him. I'm strong right now. Really strong. Nice. I'm, I'm getting an assist for that too. Good. Like, I am popping off as a top laner right now. We're completely destroying Wukong. And bot lane is destroying Aphelius and the other guy completely too, so... We got this win in our hands, guys. We've got this win completely in our hands. Awesome. They're pushing topside. We can also... We can just group up to the dragon right now. Oh, actually... Whoa! This is the fastest kind of game that I think I got on the channel right now. About a 14-minute game. Yeah, this game took about 14 minutes. It was just a complete stomp. Okay. That's interesting. Wait, let me actually see uh, how much damage we actually have. Uh, wait, uh, let me see if I can get the screen over here. Uh, if I have the option. No, I don't have the option anymore. Got to re-add it like some other time. Um, anyways, guys, we had about... Yeah, we had about 10k damage. So Wukong has had about like 4k. We did so much more. Um, anyways, guys, 
Thank you so much for watching today. Do not forget the runes. You can find it in the description as well as in the comment section. Same thing goes for the full build, guys. So make sure to check that out. And with that being said, thanks so much for watching today. And uh, I'll see you guys very soon, man. Take care.